Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Uh, Eid al Fitr 2021, Mubarak to all our uh, viewers uh, all around Australia, especially in Canberra. Uh, today uh, we have um, an Eid festival in the Canberra Islamic Center, organized by the uh, Canberra Islamic Center, and Sabah Al Ahmad Masjid, our beautiful masjid in the suburb of Monash, uh, ACT. Um, we have uh, lots of rides, uh, very delicious food organized for our Muslim families who have, alhamdulillah, come here. It's uh, a large crowd um, uh, and we have a lot of activities for children and families. Our lead brother, Amadou Bari, our best reporter in Canberra, to go through uh, each and talk to you about them. Uh, Jazakallah khair, inshallah you have a uh, lovely eat days with your families. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you very much, Brother CR, for your introduction. Inshallah, I'm going to give our viewers of a view of what is happening at the Camera Islamic Center uh, 2021 Idul Fitri Festival. As you can see, this is the uh, one of the entrance because of COVID restrictions. Members are supposed to sign up and make a gold coin donation in support of the masjid, inshallah. There are lots of activities that are going on here. Food, of course, is part of them, alhamdulillah. I will start from my left here. We've got the Jordanian cuisine stall, alhamdulillah. They serving beautiful food, nice food, alhamdulillah. And uh, on my right, from the Jordanian cuisine, is the Altaha suite. Is the Altaha suite, alhamdulillah. And beautiful suite, alhamdulillah. Assalamu alaikum, sister. How are you? We got a beautiful lineup of suites. What are these? What are the different names of these suites? Date Mamun. Nam. That's Date Mamun as well. This is Kashi Mamun. Nam. Um, the Baklava. Baklava. And then this is the. I forgot what it was called. Does it have date in it? Oh. No, it's got uh, like strawberry jam. Oh, okay. Yeah. And this one? It's just a mix of all of them. Oh, okay. Barakallah Fikum. And then you got nuts here? Yeah. Alhamdulillah. Jazakallah khair, sister. Thank you so much. How. how how are you enjoying? How are you enjoying the sales? Is it good? Yeah, Alhamdulillah. Yeah. Alhamdulillah. Thank you very much. And then also further is a stall here. Assalamu alaikum. This is uh, Egyptian food. Alhamdulillah. Of course, everybody knows Egypt, Egypt, Egyptian food is good food. Assalamu alaikum, brother. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah, it's juice, served with. Assalamu alaikum, sister. Dan. Alhamdulillah, sister, you are here. I uh, understand you are one of the organizers. Can you tell us, this is perfect timing, what is happening here? So, what's happening here today is that we organized this festival. We organized it uh, we, as in Australian Muslim Voice. Nam, with, in collaboration with. with no. And uh, so we, we've been doing this for 10 years, but we usually do it at Epic. No. So this year we did it at the Canberra Islamic Centre. Um, it's a lot of work that goes behind the scenes yes. that we spend copious hours organising no. while I'm running the radio station. Alhamdulillah. Jazakillah. So yes, we are enjoying it. And that sister, Diana Abdurrahman, <laughs> who is. Yeah, yes. We enjoy lot. Alhamdulillah. Yeah. Alhamdulillah. Yeah, we are new in Canberra. Yes. And this is like, you know, we like very much. Alhamdulillah. Here, Alhamdulillah. Canberra is, is a beautiful place. Yes. yes. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. Thank you. So, what is this? What did you get? What? Kushari. Alhamdulillah. Yes. Assalamu alaikum, brother. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Okay. I see you've had it from one of the event organizers, Sister Diana Rahman, representing the Australian Muslim Voice in collaboration with Canberra Islamic Center. Alhamdulillah. Yeah, yeah, um, Assalamu alaikum. Yes, this is Bangladesh food, right? Yeah. Yes, what are we having here? 
<laughs> are we having? What are we having? We're having sea kebab chicken and uh, chicken kebab. MashaAllah. How is sales going? Good? Very good. Alhamdulillah. Yes. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Okay. Ooh. That's beautiful. Alhamdulillah. And then I'll go out from here. Start with the right. Alhamdulillah. We have a swinger. This is a swinger ride. Alhamdulillah. Hello guys. Assalamu alaikum. Hello. Assalamu alaikum. Yeah. Okay. We leave the leave them here and move on to the next one which is the cartoon castle the cartoon castle as you can see there are kids in there having a good time assalamu alaikum assalamu alaikum From the cartoon castle, we go to the jungle bounce. The jungle bounce. Alhamdulillah. Oh, this is the jungle bounce. As you can see, there are kids in there having a good time. Alhamdulillah. More kids going in. Assalamu alaikum. This is the ticket in booth. If you want to buy ticket, this is where you come. Assalamu alaikum. As you can see, there's a large number of people queuing for tickets. This is definitely a very popular event. Alhamdulillah. This is the super char. Assalamu alaikum guys. Are you queuing to ride the super char? Alhamdulillah. The teenage girls having a good time. Queuing to go for a ride. Alhamdulillah. From the super char. We go to the cups. If you want to get dizzy, this is where you come. This is the place to be. If you want to get dizzy, this is where this is the place to be. Alhamdulillah. This is definitely a very successful Eid festival. Over a thousand people in attendance. It's fantastic. And the next one is the swinger chairs. The swinger chairs is on. People are having a good time. Assalamu alaikum, brothers. Eid Mubarak. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Kids are having a good time. It is beautiful. Assalamu alaikum. Alhamdulillah. 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 We go to the last event, activity, event the rights. And I will meet, there is the organizer here, the man who is manning the rights. Hello. Good afternoon. Hey, how are you? Good, thanks. I've just been going around, my name is Amadou. I'm a member of the Canberra Islamic Center. Just been going around making a video of the different activities that we have here. And I can see on your uh, jersey there, it says Durkin Amusement. Are all these activities part of Durkin Amusement? Or? Stairs, darling. Yes. Are all these part of your biz your company, Durkin Amusement? It's all part of the company, yes. Okay. And um, 
Has it been good so far since you started? My next one. Went real good. Really good. Really good. And what is this one? This one's a slide. This. You got a wristband, matey? Yeah. Okay. Uh. You need the flying carpet, mate. Grab a carpet to sit on. Uh, okay. That's good. Which one is the most popular of them all? As you can see, we got the slides, we got the, we have the swinger chairs. Yes. That's your carpet down the back. The carpet down the back to sit on. Okay. We got a piece of carpet down the back to sit on, guys. We got the cups, we got the super chair, jungle bounce, cartoon castle, swinger, which and the slide. Which one is the most popular? The slide. The slide is the most popular. But, uh, that's good. What was your name? Alan. Alan. Sorry to obstruct you. I think I'm disturbing you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, it's all right. <laughs> Thank you very much, Alan. Nice to meet you. Uh, okay. Alhamdulillah. Okay. Uh, Mr. Yes, brother. What's your name? Zai. Uh, um, are you having a good time? You sure? Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Oh. <laughs> you having a good time? Okay. What's your favorite ride? How many rides have you gone on? Huh? No, no, none yet. Which one you want to go on? This one, the right? Okay, no problem. Have a good time, okay? Okay, then. Assalamu alaikum. See ya, okay. Assalamu alaikum again. Look. This has been definitely a very, very successful Eid festival at the Camera Islamic Center. And look, people are having a good time. Over a thousand people. This is a very, very successful event. And credit to Allah and to the organizers, the executive committee of Camera Islamic Center in collaboration with the Australia radio station Australia Muslim Voice. Of course, you've heard from Sister Diana Abdul Rahman representing the Australian Muslim Voice. We go back to the courtyard and hopefully get to know, meet more businesses, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum, Brother Isa. How are you? <laughs> Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. As you can see, this is pizza to you. Alhamdulillah. Beautiful. We are now back at the courtyard, the Camera Islamic Center. And um, as you can see, some people are already seated, having a good food, good time. Oh. So they say. A, a festival is never complete without a face painting. Alhamdulillah. Thank you so much, sister, for doing an amazing job. This is good. Wow. What's the most popular painting you get a request for? Uh, dinosaur. Dinosaur. MashaAllah. MashaAllah. Woo! That's beautiful. Yeah, thank you so much. Are you, are you getting the help? Because definitely your hands, you get tired, right? Yeah, yeah, I get tired. Okay. Oh, okay. Alhamdulillah. Thank you very much. Okay. Going this way. Alhamdulillah. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. This is a book stall selling book. How sales going, brother? Good? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. It's good. Alhamdulillah. Okay. Alhamdulillah. Assalamu alaikum. How are you, How are you brother Ali? Yeah, good to see you. Alhamdulillah. Washallah. Just been yes, yes. sales been going on good, right? Good, good. I remember the first person bought about twenty dollars, right? In the morning when we just started. Which book 
the, is the, the is the more popular ones and that's why they're all gone. Oh, okay, the they popular ones on this side. They're for the younger kids. Okay. Um, but they're all out. Alhamdulillah, this is great. I think, what do you think about this festival today? Oh, very good. It's yeah. very good. It's been very successful, good. right? Alhamdulillah, and the weather also been very yeah. nice. Alhamdulillah, been very good. Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah. Jazakallah <laughs> khair. Okay, and we have another stall here. Alhamdulillah. Arabilat movable Arabic reading tiles. Alhamdulillah. Thank you very much. Okay. Assalamu alaikum. How are you, brother? Alhamdulillah. I can see your stall. Is, it says Arabilat movable Arabic reading tiles. What does this do? Alhamdulillah. So this is a game based um, oh. tool to teach uh, kids to learn. Uh, how to read in Arabic. Masha Allah. Alhamdulillah. Jazakallah khair. Are you selling or are you selling like the boxes and things like yeah, that? We're selling the boxes and um, it's um, also um, part of our promotion as well. Okay. Yeah. Alhamdulillah. Yeah, so it's this is the first day. We, so we just launched the product. Okay. And uh, we just familiarize with um, everyone. Alhamdulillah. So if somebody, is this available online as well? It's Arabilat, right? Yeah. Arabilat. MashaAllah. How much is the box? Thirty dollars. Alhamdulillah. You have F post, right? We don't. Oh, you don't have F post. Yes. Yeah. I think next time it will be good to have F post, inshallah. Yeah. yeah, there's definitely help. I'll try and get one, inshallah. Jazakallah khair. Thank you so much. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Alhamdulillah. We've got our EC member, the vice president of the executive committee of the Cambridge Islamic Center, who is a very strong pillar in getting things done here. Uh, Mr. Elias Mohedin, what are you going to say about this event today? Like, Alhamdulillah, it's a great success today. You know, it's an opportunity for all the all the Muslim kids yeah. and, and the community to get together and celebrate it, as well as Share that, uh, share that with the with the rest of the community as well, yeah. and and give them the opportunity to come to CIC, have a look, and and, and celebrate it together. So, Alhamdulillah, it's a great event so far. Alhamdulillah. I spoke to one of our community elder, Brother Zafar Ahmad. He said over a thousand people attended this this event. Definitely yes. Like That's that. a huge success. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah, car parks are full. The car the parks rides. across the uh, across the road from the church is full as well. Across the park is full as well. You mean the church on the other side? Other side. Yeah. Made their parking, parking spots available, available for us. Absolutely. Yeah, That's so amazing. Amazing. So it's, it's a great successful event today. It's Alhamdulillah. It's, it's, uh, it's a blessing for all the community like who helped us to be here. And uh, it's, it's, it's a team effort from the entire CRC. Alhamdulillah. Inshallah, inshallah we are planning to continue this going forward as well. Alhamdulillah. Jazakallah khair. Thank you very much for your help. I really appreciate it. And then um, also we have another stall here. It says, Australians for justice and peace in Palestine. MashaAllah. Good afternoon. Hello. How are you? Ah, I was actually hoping to see an Arab sitting behind here. Well, it says, Australian for justice and peace in Palestine. Well, yes, yes. So we're, every, we're multicultural. Yes. <laughs> That's fantastic. And so we do have some 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 sort of dinky die Australians who, one one way or another, have discovered what's happening in Palestine. Yes. For example, my wife and, and I, we we went to Palestine and Israel first of all in 2005. No. And then I went back in 2007, and we met Palestinian people and Israelis, and we did learn we learned what's going on there and we got pretty mad about the situation yes. so we've been involved as activists in, in a number of ways as advocates for justice for palestine yes. and there are other people like us but we also have um, we have we do have people who come from lebanon and uh, palestine itself yes. and uh, other other arabic countries who yes. have joined us from time to time yes. um, sometimes they're students and then they they graduate and they disappear at least they disappear from Canberra so we hope they continue the activism, activism somewhere else but, yeah. What are the biggest challenges you face? Because from what you've said here 
I'm a, a proud Australian. Yes. And I believe in our mantra of fair go yes. for everyone. Yes. And to me, justice, you're standing up for justice. Justice has no race, yes. no religion. Exactly. You just have to be a decent human being yes. to stand up for justice. Yes. So what are the challenges that you're facing? Because what the challenge, what you are taking up here, it's not an easy challenge. No, it's not. Um, uh, well, I think the challenges we face in Australia is we have a government which which also claims to be interested in a fair go. It claims to be uh, subject to the rule of law, international law, and so on. But when it comes when it comes to the crunch on particular issues, they just ignore all that. Why is that? Well, I. That's a complicated question. I suppose, so far as Palestine is concerned, um, they uh, there is a, there is quite a uh, quite a large and very noisy and uh, very well financed um, pro-Israeli community in Australia. Okay. You know, not not all not all Australian Jews, but many Australian Jews are very strong supporters of Israel. Yes. And they, I think, they have our they have our government's ear. Yes. And so our government is very reluctant to do anything which is going to be seen seen by these this group this group of pro-Israeli uh, Jewish community. Yes. Uh, they're very reluctant to upset them in any way. Okay. And they're very quick. To go to the media, you know this community. They yes. go to the media. They write articles themselves. They, in every way possible, their own media. They defend. They yes. defend what's going on in, in Israel and Palestine. They defend it from the point of view of the Israeli position. And so, for our government, it's difficult. I mean, at the moment, for example, we have a treasurer who is Jewish, and who is strong support, a strong supporter of. Of uh, Israel, yep. uh, we have members of Parliament, uh, both Labour and Liberal, who are strong supporters of, of Israel. So it becomes very difficult it is. in that context. Yes, um, I mean there are there are some members of Parliament. For example, there is a there's a parliamentary Friends of Palestine yes. group, and they do what they can, but it's difficult. Well, it's a good, but, but but it's a start. Somebody has to start yes. from somewhere and do something. Yes. Like we their do friend, what we can. yes. You know, we try to write letters to the editor, yes. opinion pieces for the news, for the media. Yes. Um, uh, we we raise money, a little bit of money, not much, but we raise some money which we send to Palestine for, mainly for humanitarian purposes yes. and so on. So we do what we can. It's, it's not a lot. It's not a lot, but yes, little drops of water yeah. makes a mighty ocean. And I think the I other hope. thing is that. Uh, when I meet Palestinians, either in Australia or when we were visiting in Palestine, yes. they tell me they have hope that one day there will be justice. Yes. And I think to myself, if they have hope, yes. then I must keep doing what I can. Thank you so yeah. much for that. What was your name again? Kevin. Kevin. Nice to meet you, Kevin. Thank you. It's a pleasure meeting you. I really appreciate it. Bye -bye. Thank you. Yes. Wish you all the best. Okay. Assalamu alaikum. How are you, brother? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Okay. And also, we have another boot here by uh, AFP, Australia Federal Police. Hello. Good afternoon. How are you? Thank you. Wow, there's drumming going on. Alhamdulillah. Hello. Hi, how are you? How are you doing? You want to say something? I uh, just recorded. I'm a member of the committee here. Oh, yeah, nice. Yes. Yeah, just Sorry making a video, a video. Yes. Awesome. Yes. About the activities and yeah. going on. And you also have a stall here. Yeah. yeah. Good getting the kids. Yes. Home and stuff. Okay. That's great. So, what's the purpose of having a stall in a Eid festival? I think, of course, there are kids yeah. there having a good time. Yeah. yeah. Just um, just to chat with members of the community and things like that, break down some barriers, yes. get, make people you know, know that we're approachable. Is it okay if I can give you? Yeah, you you say, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. cool. Yeah, you said uh, breaking barriers. Yeah. 
you, you don't want anybody else between the po the, the, pub the public and the, yeah. and the police. Yeah, that's amazing. So, so we're just encouraging them to come up and chat with us and have fun and yeah, have a good time here. That's amazing. Yeah. Thank you so much. I no really worries. appreciate it. I want to see your name again. Matt. Matt. Yeah. Hey, nice to meet you, Matt. This is really interesting. Some of us, our experience with the police is totally different. Yeah. yeah. Here, to be frank with you, the police go out to extend a hand of friendship to the community. Yeah. You know, people trust the police. Yeah. Yeah, that's what we want to build on. Yes. And keep, that's amazing. Keep that happening. So. It's good. We're happy to be out here and amongst it all. And when I came to Australia, actually, I wanted to be a police officer. Yeah. But then I ended up in IT, yeah. and I got picked up by the government to yeah. do it. <laughs> but Never I still enjoy late. doing it because... Never too late. Yeah. I know, it's, <laughs> it's too late. It's too late now, I think. Yeah. You know? Nah. Never too late. You could come do IT stuff over here. Even. Okay. Late, yeah. Not a problem. I'll very take good. that off, man. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you. Hello, assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum, guys. Okay. I think I have covered most of what is going on here at the 2021 Canberra Islamic Centre Australia Muslim Boys Eid Festival. Assalamu alaikum, brother. How are you? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Good to see you. And Yes, it's been an amazing and a successful event. And just a few more interviews, and I think we wrap up and hand you back to the studio. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. These are the, the two brothers. <laughs> this is brother Sohail Khan, this is brother Abdul Hasib Khan. The lovely brothers, my and, elder brothers. And I'm the more handsome of the three. <laughs> uh, no, doubtful. doubtful. Let's, that's doubtful, yes. <laughs> Let's leave that to the viewers to decide. The viewers will see <laughs> their votes. Brother, Has, Brother Zafar said, we have over a thousand people attend this event today. Yeah, inshallah. What's your take? Yeah, I think there are more than thousand people. Yes. Because they were coming and going. Mm. So you can see at least five, six hundred pe people are here yes. at this time. Yes. So, and and uh, my my brother of the Lasid, he has been eating non-stop. <laughs> <laughs> Since he has come, he's only having kebab. <laughs> but he's, he doesn't have one right no, now. No, he's, oh, he's trying to push the kebab down. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. I think this is a very good program today. Yes. And more than a thousand people have yes. come. Yes. Over a thousand. Coming and going. Yes. So, uh, and the good thing is that the, all the, the Muslim community is here. So all, from, 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 from all over. From all over. It's, and it, it's, it's not only the south side. There. It's become a meeting point. Yes. So that is the main thing we have achieved. We've got the venue. And yeah. Alhamdulillah, we utilize the venue today for what it's supposed to do. And the other thing is, the children are very happy. Yes. And they are thinking that, yes, we is celebrated like this. Yes. And we, we were just, just talking in the executive committee, just with a few members. Okay. That we should have something like this for Eid al -Adha. Yes, definitely. Because uh, it is such a success. We, got, we have the bazaar. And then we had a festival for the two eats. Yeah. I was thinking we'll have the bazaar, the clothes, the food, and everything on one day, on a Sunday after Eid al Okay. So that way, bigger and bigger and better. Yes. Inshallah. Inshallah. It. Inshallah. Jazakallah khair. Jazakallah khair. Okay. Assalamu alaikum. Salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. And. Thank you very much. I think we've had an amazing day at the Canberra Islamic Center. This is your reporter, Ahmad Ubari, covering the Eid Festival within the courtyard, reporting to you from the courtyard of the Canberra Islamic Center. It's been an amazing experience, and I'm now going to hand you back to the studio, to my editor and my director, Siar Azhar. Thank you, Brother Siar.